Hi there learners and in today's video we're going to be talking about calculating and you can see in brackets I've put there with no calculator. Dan, dan, dan. <laughs> okay, no calculator. Um, when we deal with this particular topic, just remember there is a section for not using the calculator and the other one where we will be using the calculator. Right, so um, just as it is very important to know how to use your calculator correctly, which we'll do in, in uh, upcoming videos, it is just in, as important to be able to do calculations in your head and not always rush off to grab the nearest calculator. I mean, think about this. If you're in the shop, if you need to estimate something, if you need to round off uh, or work out something, you don't always have a calculator at hand. So we're going to look at some um, hints and tips where it comes to calculating without our calculator. So when we multiply, for example, by 10, all we need to do is just add the appropriate number of zeros to an existing number. So if I'm saying 237 multiplied by 10, what am I essentially saying? I'm just adding a zero. And there's my answer. If I've got a number like 456,730 and I want to multiply that even by a thousand, what am I doing? I'm going to be adding those three zeros. So it's four, five, six, seven, three, oh, zero, zero, zero. Sounds like a cell phone number. Okay, so there I've got all that. When I am dividing, so now I'm not multiplying anymore. I'm now dividing, let's say I'm dividing by 10 and I've got a number like this, 237, and I want to divide that by 10. What am I now doing? 237 is basically this, 237, zero but we don't show that, okay, because it's a whole number. When I divide by 10, I'm essentially taking that comma and I'm moving it one space forward, all right? So now 237 divided by 10 becomes 23 comma 7. What about this big number? Let's move this up. Uh, if I use 456,730 and I want to divide that by a thousand. Remember what am I saying? It's four five six seven three zero comma zero. So what am I going to be doing with a thousand? I'm going to be taking it and I'm going to be moving it one, two, three um, spaces forward. Right? Why am I moving the comma three spaces? Because I've got three zeros. So this number then moves from being four hundred and fifty six thousand seven hundred and thirty to being four hundred and fifty six comma 730. Oh, 